So today I'm going to take you on a graffiti walking tour through Red Hook, Brooklyn. It was sort of like a no man's land for a long period of time up until the past like five, less than five years, they leveled everything that was somewhat interesting. I mean, what I'm going to show you in this video is literally all that's left. I mean, correct me, feel free to correct me if I missed something that would have been cool to show in the video, but I'm just showing what I know and what, what I saw. So yeah, I'm gonna also share a story about the Red Hook Grain Terminal. I'll throw in some old footage of that. I remember this was an abandoned building. This was, just, this was like this huge abandoned building. They renovated it. This is all brand new. There was like another level. Like even when you went to the roof, there was like, I guess they called it the crow's nest or something. It was like a whole nother level. And I have some video from up there. The fact alone that like, like, how does anyone even find a spot like this to, to paint? I mean, it's not, there's nothing in the building anymore. It's been completely gutted and stripped and renovated, but it was just like this crazy experience climbing that ladder, but, and seeing this, like these amazing pieces. So yeah, that's, you know, that was just a thing of the past now.
I have some uh, video clips from, from about seven years ago from when I was a little more adventurous and uh, definitely, it's definitely a pretty interesting spot to explore. I don't recommend it present day. It's just, uh, it's not a good idea. But I'll try to throw in some old clips from uh, about seven years ago. Wow, they're doing some really crazy construction over here too. You used to be able to walk out and this whole thing wrapped around. There's insane construction going on right now in Red Hook. Like every massive lot is just demolished. There's two of these fields that are just completely overgrown. I think it's pretty interesting. I mean, these, uh, it's a football field. I remember when these were I think there was a soccer field and the other field and a baseball field. They just let them overgrow and I don't know what, they, what they're what they doing with it. In the country, this tall grass would probably have like ticks and, uh, and poison ivy. Uh, there's no ticks here, but you know what's in there? There's probably rats. There's probably a lot of rats in there. All right, this makes sense. Um, I was really curious why all these fields were closed. So it's uh, the contaminated soil. They're basically... They're working on... Uh, I don't know if they're gonna... What, exactly what they're doing, but that's why these fields are sitting here abandoned. You can't really tell from watching this video right now. I'm just panning by showing you. There's the construction boards. It's completely leveled and they're digging in the ground and Ikea's there. This all used to be abandoned. It was just an abandoned lot with like cinder blocks. And there were some really, really classic pieces in that lot. It was a really like secret DL spot. People didn't, went there and they, people went there and they did like really great pieces. 